Today in this video, I'm gonna showcase my top five favorite truly wireless earbuds of 2024. And I'm gonna kick things off with the number five spot, the most budget friendly. These are the J Buds Mini. And I've been watching the comments of last year's video. Some of you guys are saying $100 is a lot of money for earbuds, but hold this. This is only $40, but the price aside, do these suck? Are they any good? Now, let me tell you, these are tiny very tiny it's designed for people who have small ears and i can put them right on i have a great fit you also have bluetooth multiple points so you can be able to pair up your iphone and android it is splash proof coming in at ip55 and even watching videos now everything is one-to-one -one. i think for 30 bucks this is pretty good <laughs> i'm here getting distracted watching youtube but i gotta get going with this video these are pretty good um, unfortunately, there's no wireless charge, just a basic earbuds. I think these are a win. I mean, the sound quality is surprisingly good. This is perfect for those secret Santas. You don't want to break the bank and earbuds is something that you can never have too many of anyway. The touch, the, the actual in-ear bud are a little finicky. This is a microphone test of the J Buds Mini. Tell me who can catch a toucan, Luke can, just how a few can, ride the toucan, Two can, what kind of glue can? <laughs> what kind of glue can? Stick it to the two can, glue can. This is a microphone test of the J Buds Mini. Tell me who can catch a two can, glue can, just how few can, ride the two can, two can, what kind of glue can? Stick it to the two can, glue can. Let me know down in the comments down below how's the microphone test or a microphone quality. Uh, yay, nay, dope, nope. Let me know down in the comments down below. And next up on the list, we have the Sony WF-C510. I had to look at my screen because Sony doesn't really have the best track records when it comes down to the names. But I got to say, this is another budget-friendly option. This is only going to run you $60. But you won't want mini headphones. You want an actual real-size earbuds. And that is where this is going to come into play. This is a full-size earbuds, truly wireless and everything. But at a more affordable price. So gotta tell you, just like the J Buds Mini, these fit good. I would say the J Buds Mini fit a little bit better for my ear type because I have really tiny ears. But I gotta say, just looking at the color and just the way how the case is, this is pretty tiny too as well. You could pair up to two Bluetooth devices simultaneously. And of course, with the Sony app, you can adjust the EQ to your liking. And I gotta say the sound quality is pretty rich on this. The days of buying, like those $20 earbuds and they sound like crap. I think those days are done. And you guys already know, Sony is known for making quality earbuds that sound fantastic. And this one here is no exception. Now, unfortunately there's no ANC, active noise canceling. So it's only ambient sound and there's no charger included in the box. So you will need to provide your own type C cable for charging. It blocks out the noise a little bit better too as well. Even though there's no noise canceling, it, it does a better job canceling out the noise thanks to the larger uh, silicone tips. And I actually love the button controls on the Sony's because having to touch sometimes can be a little finicky. This is a microphone test of the WFC510. Tell me who can catch a two can, Lou can, just how a few can, ride the two can, two can, what kind of glue can, stick it to the two can, glue can. Let me know down in the comments down below, how's the microphone? And alrighty, next up on the list, we have the Soundcore Open Earbuds. Now, if you're a fan of open earbuds, this one is gonna be for you. These cost $100. These are the Soundcore C40i. Um, I think this is perfect for if you're gonna go outside to run. So you, it's important to be aware of your surroundings while having that almost like non-existent fit. But yeah, and just putting them on just to have that open feel. Now you do have the Soundcore app so you can adjust the EQ. You also have multi-point Bluetooth so you can connect uh, two phones, two devices simultaneously. You also have an intuitive control button. So that's how you play pause, skip reverse tracks. And the button is easy to click to. This is a microphone test of the Soundcore C40i. Tell me who can, catch a two can, Lou can. Just how a few can, ride the two can, Two can, what kind of glue can stick it to the two can glue can? Let me know down in the comments down below. How's the microphone quality? Next, we have the AirPods 4 
generation or airpods fourth generation and this is the one with noise canceling and i reviewed these already i made a separate video on it and without a doubt these are the most approved airpods i mean i didn't like airpods 3 just because of the fit but these are just a different story and you have noise canceling which you can enable disable and not to mention these are airpods so once you pair it up to your iphone all your devices are paired up such as your mac your ipad your apple watch the sound quality is actually excellent good amount of bass like really good Ooh, yeah these are better these are probably the best sounding earbuds out of the previous ones that i reviewed because these have like that spatial audio just these just sounds a little bit more punchy and it doesn't even stop there you do have your gestures so if you're receiving a phone call you can shake your head yes to answer or nod your head no to decline the call and of course these are airpods so you know these are going to have the best microphone quality this is a microphone test of the apple airpods 4 tell me who can catch a toucan a lucan just how a few can ride the toucan toucan what kind of glue can stick it to the toucan glue can yeah, without a doubt, these sound pretty clear, but let me know down in the comments down below, how does the AirPods 4 stack up against the Soundcore, the Sony, the J Buds? Let me know down in the comments down below. Now, side note, this isn't officially on my list, but AirPods Pro 2 just gotten better. It received a free update, so you could be able to check your hearing. So it has built-in hearing aids, and I just recently did a test two days ago, and I have perfect hearing. Well, not perfect, but it's good hearing, so, um, now, if you update your iPhone, you could be able to do a proper hearing test, which is FDA approved. So that's pretty good. So the already amazing AirPods 2 just gotten better with that free software update. This is a microphone test of the AirPods Pro 2. Tell me who can catch a toucan, Lou can, just how a few can ride the toucan, toucan, what kind of glue can stick it to the toucan, glue can. Now, I didn't need to do a test of the AirPods Pro, but just so you guys can hear the difference between the AirPods 4 and the AirPods Pro, you guys be able to judge between the two. And last but not least, we have the Google Pixel Buds 2. And I gotta tell you, man, this, I think I saved the best for last. You guys see the little, like the little nook on the side of the buds? That goes a long way, premium. I love the way how the case feels. And not to mention, the case actually has a speaker on the bottom alongside the Type-C for charging. And you have wireless charge to put the ice on the cake. And if you single tap it, you either play pause or answer the phone call. Double tapping is going to get to the next track or reject the call. Yeah, these sound pretty good. Woo! Yes, just like AirPods. Literally just like AirPods. Noise canceling is excellent. The sound quality is excellent. The pairing is seamless. It, it's that good. It's really that good, guys. I I said pretty much all these AirPods sound good, but these are good. AirPods and these, neck on neck, I would say. Now, maybe the only kind I'll say with transparency mode or ambient mode, there's a very slight hiss. It's not too loud, but it's definitely noticeable. This is a microphone test of the Google Pixel Buds 2. Tell me who can catch a toucan, a lucan, just how a few can ride the toucan, toucan, what kind of glue can stick it to the toucan, glue can. Let me know down in the comments down below, how's the microphone? And you know what's crazy? It is also compatible with your iPhone too as well. So if you press and hold the back, you could be able to pair it up to your iPhone too as well. And ladies and gentlemen, there you guys have it. Those are my top five truly wireless earbuds of 2024 let me know down in the comments down below what you guys think and drop a like on this video help me out tremendously and make sure you guys subscribe with notifications on and other than that i hope you all have a simple day